Hello everyone, welcome back. We're back with some F1 manager. And we can finally do the second race that never happened. <laughs> that I couldn't do last time. Here we go. We are at Jeddah and I want to see what I can do before the weekend starts. I completely forgot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I do center. Upgraded. I ideally wanted to level 5. Also had a look at staff. I might have to ex renew their contracts. I mean, it makes sense. I feel like I should before I leave this team. I also want to try scouting because why not? I want to see if that translates when I change teams. I've never changed teams in this game yet. Okay, that's done. What else can I do? I think that's about it. Get the helipad upgrade. Okay. Get this upgraded again. Oh no, something is meant to happen. Sponsors VIP XP. Oh, this could be good. I'm going to approve it. Payout increased by three times if it doesn't matter. Okay, I'm going to approve this. I think we can do with this. Weather center. I would like to upgrade it again. Get helipad to level 5 as well, so... Ooh, can I manufacture it before the race? How much would that cost? Um, if I rush to, I'll get both of them before Melbourne. But if I do an emergency one, that is 4.4 mil. Uh, do I do one in emergency? I'm thinking like doing about one in emergency. I'm going to do one in emergency. Just one, just one. And then I'm going to rush one. Performance targets. Q2 and wow. Qualifying top four now. I'm gonna keep it down because everything is gonna be doubled. So, wow, so much money. Finish position, top eight, both cars. I'm gonna earn a lot from this race. While I'm at it, I'm gonna design a rear wing before the weekend takes off. Okay, so design the rear wing. That is done, looks fine. Okay, <clears throat> now we have one part for the new car, and that is the chassis one. And given Charles' performance in the last race, it makes sense to give it to him. Just saying. So I want to look at the analysis of both cars now. There we have car 2 versus... Hmm, medium and high speed is a big difference right now. But how far is this upgrade off Red Bull? Not a lot, but quite a bit. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, this is going to be a bit... But we have an upgrade on the car, so let's start the weekend. So here we are in practice. I'm gonna finish the practice and I'm gonna be back in qualifying. Okay, we're done with the practice and look at this. We might genuinely be contenders for the race winning race win here because practice three result charles is 1.9 seconds faster than max this is ridiculous and that's something i noticed from like the first p1 p2 sessions as well we are consistently faster here in every session and we also got like 100 percent setup on charles 96 you know you win some you lose some not interested in what you have to say so this is what's surprising like practice one you see on hard tires we have a seven tenth and it was a hard tire i had done 36 laps on seven tenths to max of stappen carlos almost the same but charles has a new chassis on practice two we're close but these were like 30 percent mediums like i pushed them all the way to the end and in practice three this is just ridiculous i think we have genuine chance of winning the race one two easily so that's what they're going to aim for the entire race. Let's get into the weekend. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Come on. There's no way. There's no way. Ah, oh, you imbecile. We're out. I actually left it down to one run and we're out. We're straight up out. <laughs> wow. Wait, are we? Is there time? Oh, there are three minutes. Okay. Okay, I'll stop crying. I'm gonna do it on the same tire. I almost cried. Just straight up go out. Don't wait. All right, Q1. And what is Charles's time gonna be? Nice, he crosses the line. I almost thought that this Q1 was over. Okay. I set it on the used tire anyway. Let's get to Q2. Seems safe. 
that session was scary. I almost thought we were out. That red flag came out of nowhere. That Nico Hulkenberg almost ruined us. And know what? I'm gonna take the risk in this ses session. I have no idea why I'm struggling with talking, but we move on. I'm gonna go with the same tire. Again, I want to save two sets of softs for the race. That is my strategy. I want two sets of softs for the race. Yeah, let's go. All right, here we are at the death of the session. We're gonna see what lap time they set up. Hopefully they don't get held up as well. I left enough gap for both of them to set a lap time. Oh no. Every time I see a car, the first thing that comes out of my mouth is, oh no. You're holding him up? You idiot. Yeah, that's how you let pass. All right, let's see what Charles is gonna do. Nice. Here he comes. That's what she said. <laughs> Use tires, please, 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 please. Oh, very good. I almost, I almost held my breath. What about? Oh, nice. Use tires. Two softs are safe. Very good. Let's move on to Q3. We, we are championing. Like, we are playing this like a champion. We are the champions. Alright. I don't think Russell is on a lap, is he? No, he's not. Okay, that's done. Let's move to Q3. The target in Q3 is pole. Like, we genuinely have the pace for that. I don't know if we're gonna get it, but I'm okay as long as we're in the top four. Hopefully not these positions. Let's start. And I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna set the time at the death hour. That's my plan. Q3. Hopefully it goes well. I hope nobody gets held up. It does look like they will. There is Alonso, who is driving ridiculously slow behind Gasly, who is in front. And they're closing fast on them. But before that, there is Magnussen. And I'm not sure he's gonna let us pass. No, no, actually, he's on a fast lap. Alonso and Gasly are also on a fast lap. That's what it looks like, so... Actually, that's worse, because we're gonna catch him. Oh, no. I didn't think this through. Leclerc is gonna catch him. He's visibly catching him. Like, I know it doesn't look like it, but he's catching him. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Sometimes I just get so paranoid and terrified. He was close, though. Wow. What's his lap time? Please tell me it's pole. It's not pole. Go to hell. You have pole pace. What's going on? Leclerc was faster than this. I swear to God he was faster than this. No, I was actually wrong. Charles' fastest time was 27.9. Over the course of weekend, that was his fastest time. And Red Bull's 27.4. I have no idea where that pace came from. They never had that for the entire weekend. How do you go from 28, 29, 9 to straight up 27.4? Like, where do you find two seconds? What's going on? Anyways, I need to make a strategy that helps with the race. So give me a moment. I done the math. I looked at the strategy. And I think I'm going to do a two stop. I'm going to split them in the tires in the first phase. One is going to go on a medium. Another is going to go on a soft, but both are going to attack in the first stand. That's the strategy. That's it. That's my done. And you know, actually what I'm going to do as a side note, I'm going to put in a fresh engine. I think this might be a good strategy, putting in a fresh engine before this weekend and a fresh, fresh gearbox, I guess. Should I put in like a fresh ERS as well? Yeah, why not? You never know when you have to take a penalty. So I think I'm going to put fresh components in for this weekend like literally push everything i want one to this race and i feel like it's possible as long as they don't mess it up so i think we have done everything and let's move on with the race yeah here we go all right don't crash if this happens to me again i'm gonna cry all right come on oh no already how has science lost a place already dude I know this is gonna be a race for the first five. The first five laps are gonna be important. I don't know what's going on. 
You know, I just noticed my game was not recording audio. What? I was not recording audio till now. I'm so stupid. My god. Hopefully now it must have worked. At least for the race I got the audio. Alright. Hopefully Charles will have to endure for the first few laps. I'm guessing. Actually, you know what? I'm not gonna make him push for the first few laps because the AI are gonna do the opposite for the first few laps. Don't defend. There's no point in defending because these idiots will kill their tires. And I think that's good. I think for the first few laps, it's all about enduring. But afterwards, we're gonna come right back into it. Science also has that problem. He has a gap to Hamilton, but it doesn't matter. Hamilton is on softs. Alonso is on softs. Verstappen is on mediums. Paris is on mediums. Leclerc is on softs. This is good. I'm gonna make them push just after AI's kill their tires. So let's move on to that phase. Let's move on to lap 5. So here we are at lap 5. I think now I'm gonna make them push. Now it makes more sense to push because the AI have killed their tires at this point. You see that already? Alonso has gone to 77, Leclerc is on 81 and technically the strategy is to push your tires for the first stint. That was my plan. And now you see, Leclerc is opening up a gap of a second to Alonso, he's already done that. Science is already back on the Mr. Hamilton. Sir Hamilton, all right. You know what to do, lad. Oh. Hamilton has clearly learned a lot from the Minister of Defense. Oh no. Is Hamilton gonna try a repass? No man. Don't let him pass. Go. Yeah, it's done. Sainz is already getting close and closer to Alonso and we want that. We don't really care about the rest. And Leclerc is pressuring the Red Bulls. This is exactly what we want. Wow. Nice. Keep going, boy. I mean, I don't think Charles is gonna get away from Perez, but... It's worth the try. Sure, go ahead. Do it. Let's take a closer look. Now this is Sergio Perez. He got the and DRS. By. Oh, he got the DRS. I thought Charles got the DRS there. Damn. This guy, come on. He's good. Head now. You're doing well. Why are you crying? Science is also doing well. Charles is also doing well. Charles did the same thing again. He gave him DRS again. Like, how the hell are you making the same mistake again and again? What's going on, man? Science is losing time. He's battling with Alonso too much. I need to make him attack. And I think it's time. I don't care. Leclerc also has to keep attacking. I don't care. I actually want the tires, like, the temperatures to drop a bit. But I should have kept Ch Science on the attack so that his he would have dropped Alonso in the previous lap. Why are you doing this again and again, Charles? You're just pissing me off now. How hard it is to get him out of his DRS. Like, seriously. For science, he's just dragging Alonso. Oh my god. This is gonna be long. Drop him, man. What's going <laughs> I can't believe, like, Alonso is managing to stick with science, who is clearly getting closer and closer to the top two. I can't just believe this. 
<laughs> That's so ridiculous, man. Wow. Um, obviously going soft. Ooh, this could be some thing. What's your delta? Could be. Big oh, I didn't see that. Careful. I didn't see that. I didn't see that. Red Bull okay. implosion. He's okay. Better stick with Stappen now. Okay. This is the best time to box, man. And keep it tidy. How much time is he gonna lose? 17 seconds. 17. He's gonna come out like just after stroll. What about science? Should I make him pit? My gut is telling me to make him pit. Uh, I think I'm gonna make him pit. Yep, I'm gonna make him pit as well. There is a large enough gap to go into. Box. Copy. Pitling. Okay. Yeah. Hopefully, no hold up. Nice. Double stop. Now that's my guys. Come on, come on. Oh my god. A I second. Yeah, I cannot as well. Copy that, Tony. But it's done. What is the pit lane saying, man? Nice. Nice. Juicy. Real. F juicy. Heat up that tire. That is a master stroke. Right there. We have literally saved like half a pit stop. This is Leclerc's race to lose at this point. Such a great game. I love this game. Alright, safety car is gone. Leclerc is already on the back of Alonso. I mean, uh, Stroll, Stroll, not Alonso. What am I thinking? For some reason, he cannot detect. They're just fighting with each other. This is gonna be bad. And science is not that far off, to be honest. I'm gonna let him look after his softs for a short time because tires are overheating here for some reason. Charles needs to overtake these guys ASAP. He's losing so much time behind them. Nice. Nice. One problem child sent away. What about problem child 2? Nice. Oh, before the DRS line. Did he overtake him before the DRS line? That's essential. Oh no, he didn't. I don't mind if Sainz looks after his tires before he catches Hamilton. So, let's move on. So here we have Sainz in the back of Hamilton. He's also doing quite well. He's really pushing him there. Just go on the complete attack, man. Oh my god. Yep, 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 drop him as well. Ooh, almost, almost. That was close. Leclerc, already on the back of Alonso here. Like, we're making moves here. The freeze pitch stop issue, nobody cares. Okay, nice, nice. Getting closer, closer. Ah, smell that Spanish thing. Oh, he pitted, he pitted. Please tell me he gets held up. He's also a problem. No, I did not. Fire Perez is on softs. He's probably going to hards, I think, if he's going this long. Considering Alonso also went to a mediums, I think, yeah, he's going to the end. It's a one stop. And we're two stopping with both cars, so. We will have the pace advantage. And Verstappen out of the picture. Perez took him out, so. That's a great thing for us. Yep, Perez is in. Mediums. I don't think he had any delay. Will he come out in front of. Yeah, it does seem like he did. Now, they're gonna do a madness with their tires. Just wanna have a look at the track details. Temperatures are high, it does look like the wear is gonna be high towards the end, so I think I did a good thing, I went to two stop. Two stop is the way to go here. 
So I think this is gonna be a boring race now for a few laps. So I'm just gonna get it rolling to the pit stop, lap 21. And I think we'll have to wait till the pit stop or one of them crashes. That's that's the only thing. And box now, box. So here we are, lap 34. And boxing both cars to softs. An increase pushing a status a bit more. Coffee. I think Leclerc has a good chance to win. Will signs come in P2? I have no idea. I think that's very unlikely. But towards the end of the race, you never know. He could. Because I think Leclerc is going to easily come out in behind Perez. I could be wrong though. Oh my god, Leclerc got held up. Where is he? Yeah, behind Perez. Sainz also came out in a very good place, I would say. It wasn't as worse as I thought it would be. That's what I'm gonna say. So both of them are on softs. The guys in front of them are on used tires. They simply have to catch them and overtake them. That's basically the race done then. So let's see when that happens. So at the moment, science has caught up with Mr. Alonso. This is gonna be interesting. And the Claire has gotten visibly closer to Perez as well. He might overtake him this or the next lap and then I'll make him push for a lap. You can push. Okay, I actually yeah. forgot. Overtake aggression must be on high. Yeah, I forget about these things sometimes. Because, you know, I am stupid. So does Charles overtake him? He does. There we go. That's a race win. Don't mess it up again. Why? 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 You what are you doing? Flying out there. Very good. That was the lap. That was the lap you were supposed to overtake him, Sainz. Yes, of course. He overtakes him just before the DRS zone. What a genius. Come on, man. What's going wrong with you? You have disappointed me so much, uh, science. Like, what have you done? You have fallen for the Alonso strat, man. But, luckily, luckily, there was an alpha in the way. Oh my god. Now I just need to wait signs to catch to Perez. Let's see if that happens. One, two. It's happening. Okay, lap 49. Science has gotten within one second, but I don't know if he will be able to overtake him. I think he will overtake him here on the last lap. I'm gonna make him push like crazy. That's my plan. We need to push for these laps. You're doing a good job. Yeah, copy that. You can catch him. Come on, yeah. That's what we need to hear. You can catch him. Let's see. You can catch him and you can pass him. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That's what happened to their tires. 36% tires versus 58% softs. That's what happens when AI is dumb. Come on. Go. Go for it. Send him to Kingdom Come. That's my boy. Hopefully. I don't think he will be able to catch him. Yes! One. Yeah, you're a fantastic race. Two. One, two. That's Leclerc! Joe Leclerc is today's winner. Boss just lap it. Take it back. Oof. P2, P2. Oh. What? That was uh, really nice to drive. Yeah, that was a smooth operation. Kind of. 
Good job. Base was Sorry, there. Oh, nice. So Leclerc finishes in P1, Sainz in P2, Perez in P3, Alonso P4, Stroll P5, Hamilton P6, Russell P7, Ocon P8, Magnussen P9, and Gasly P10. Nice. It all happened because, you know, the Red Bull managed to kill the other Red Bull. I think it would have been a 1-3 if Verstappen was still there. So, a double stop around Jeddah works. Oh, last lap. Gasly and Magnussen. He goes on the side, but he hasn't covered. Nice. That was close. Magnussen would have caught him. Like, if one more lap was given. Alright, race end. Now isn't that the kind of drive we love to see from Charles Leclerc? We love to see it. It was a truly excellent win, with everything working together for the team and driver. Yep, mostly. And you love to see this. The whole team celebrating this magnificent result. Yeah, mostly it was Out me, but, the podium steps you know. Charles Leclerc, the driver from Monaco, really deserving of that top three spot. Nice. It gets even better for the team with both drivers scoring a podium finish this weekend. No, one, two, not just podium, one, two. That's a big thing. And there's a constructor as well. Now the drivers can relax after an eventful weekend at the Saudi Arabian Grand Prix. I wish they would add the exact same trophies. I don't know if that has licensing problems or whatnot, but that would be amazing if they would. Sergio in the same exact place as the last weekend. As far as Ferrari are concerned, Karun, how do you think they'll be feeling after that race? They need to hire more employees. I doubt they could be much happier. A yeah. win and a podium place. What a great way to round out the weekend. Yeah. Let's move on. What a weekend. We don't have the qualifying pace, we have the race pace. Unlike real life. 25, P19, he got the fast lap on the last lap. Even with a slower car, like... Charles had the upgrade, Carlos didn't, but Carlos still delivered. Nice. I think that uh, virtual safety car really actually helped. I don't think the two-stop would have worked without <laughs> That's for sure. So, it's between Carlos and Charles. Charles has so far won two races, Carlos has won none. But he's his closest challenger so far. So, if Carlos genuinely has pace on weekends, I'm not gonna... Like, make Charles overtake him, it doesn't make any sense. So we are clear in the constructors at the moment, but you know, they could just crash and everything could change, so... Uh, in terms of... DHL fastest pit stop, we got 8th and 9th, they weren't the fastest, but you know, we're there, close to there, and hopefully we'll get there slowly and steadily. Hmm. I think we'll get there. I think we'll get there towards the mid part of the season wait oh driver bonuses i thought i lost money because i doubled the sponsor expectations 5.9 mil for one race those sponsor payouts are really helpful <laughs> okay that was fun next one is australia okay nothing in there and i hope you enjoyed that i certainly did until then i'll Take care of yourself and I'll see you guys next time. I'm actually feeling like sleepy for some reason. Because actually these videos take so much long time than it actually looks because these videos go for an hour. One race goes easily for an hour because I do the practice very well all the way through. Okay. There's nothing much in the upgrades, car facilities. I don't want to feel like upgrading the car facilities, team hub, nothing like that. We have like 12 mil and do I need more? I don't think I do. I'm gonna say because the next race we're gonna have two upgrades and we are gonna Dello, make more. So till then take care of yourself. I'll see you guys next time. Remember to like, dislike, subscribe. Goodbye.